Hello everyone, I am Miss Hu, your physics teacher. In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix the zero errors on an ammeter as well as a voltmeter. What if we get an ammeter where it shows us a value even though it's not connected to a circuit just like this? This kind of error is known as a zero error. A zero error is the situation where the measuring instrument shows us a non-zero reading even though it's not measuring anything, which means it's supposed to give us the value of a zero. Depending on the measuring instrument that you have, it's really easy to fix. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix the zero errors on an ammeter as well as a voltmeter. The way we fix it is exactly the same. So for analog ammeters and voltmeters, you'll find there's normally a screw in the middle of the device Sometimes it's black, sometimes it's white, sometimes it's silver in color, depending on the ammeter or voltmeter that you have. So for this particular ammeter, the screw requires a flathead screwdriver. Of course, do check what kind of screw is on your ammeter or voltmeter and use the appropriate screwdriver accordingly. So all we need to do is just place a screwdriver into the groove of the screw and then twist it in the correct direction to align the needle to point to zero. If the meter has an anti-parallax mirror, just like this ammeter, ensure that when the needle is pointing to zero, the needle is overlapping its own reflection to avoid parallax error. Here's another example. In this case, I'm using a voltmeter. So although the voltmeter doesn't have an anti-parallax mirror, you still do the same thing. Just ensure that our eye is aligned as best as we can perpendicular to the scale as we're making the adjustment to ensure that the needle is pointing to zero. And that's how we can fix the zero errors on an ammeter as well as a voltmeter. So I hope you found this video helpful in understanding a little bit more about physics lab apparatus. So don't forget to like and subscribe for more physics videos from your physics teacher, Miss Ho.